everybody and welcome back to my channel. So today I am doing my June wrap up. I am kind of late on doing this. Is when I'm filming this video it is the month middle of July. Um, so I'm a little late on getting it up, but uh, I, it's about time I shared what books I read with you guys in the month of June because I read only four books in the month of June, but the majority of them I really did enjoy. Um, there was only one I did not like, and I will get to that in a second. I also have a very exciting announcement coming at the end of this video, so if you guys would like to know what that is, please stay tuned to the end of the video to find out, because I am very excited to announce what it is to you guys. And that this exciting announcement kind of played in part into why I did not read as many books as I thought I was going to read in the month of June. So, on my TBR in the month of June, if you guys saw that video, I had a pretty large TBR. I think I had 14 books total. Um, and again, I only read four of those books because, well, one, of, three of them were a part of a series that I was, like, dying to finish. And then one was um, the Fruit Utopia Book Club Book of the Month. So, let's just jump right in. The first three books, like I said, are part of the same series, and those are the last three books in the Percy Jackson in the Olympians series. Um, there are The Titan's Curse, The Battle of the Labyrinth, and The Last Olympian. I have a review out for the first three books in the series out on my channel. Um, I'll link those in the description box below. I also have reviews for all five books on my blog, which I'll also link in the description box below. Um, overall, I really enjoyed the series. Um, I gave The Titan's Curse a 5 out of 5 stars. It was great. I really liked the introduction of, um, you know, quite a bit of new characters that we had. Nico, Bianca, the Hunters of Artemis, um, Zoe, and then we had uh, Talia, who is the daughter of Zeus. And I really liked all the new characters. I have, I talked more in detail about them on my review. Like, like I said, it will be linked in the description box below. Um, so I gave that a 5 out of 5 stars, like I said. The Battle of the Labyrinth was my favorite book of the series. I really enjoyed it. Um, I loved everything that went on in it. Um, I, like I said, I'll have a review out for that in the next probably couple of days, but I do have a review out on my blog already. And I just loved the Battle of the Labyrinth. I thought it was just amazing. You know, Rick Riordan never seems to, um, disappoint me in any of his books. Like, I've read the entire Percy Jackson series now, and I've read uh, one of his other books, which was the Red Pyramid, um, Pyramid, excuse me, which was part of the Kingdom Chronicles series, and I also really enjoyed that. Um, so I was really excited to finish up the Percy Jackson series, so I gave that Battle of the Labyrinth a 5 out of 5 stars. And then the last book is The Last Olympian, and <laughs> I was not disappointed again. It was just phenomenal. It was slow for me at times. Um, but I really did enjoy it for me, um, it myself. Um, it's probably my second favorite out of the series. Um, like I said, The Battle of the Labyrinth, it was probably my favorite. Um, I really it did enjoy it. So I gave the, uh, Last Olympian a 4.5 out of 5 stars. Like I said, it was a little slow for me at times, but I really did enjoy it once we got really into, like, at the beginning, it was just a tiny bit slow for me. But once we get to, like, the action parts, then excuse me, it really picked up. So I really enjoyed that book as well. And overall, I really liked the series. I'll have a video coming up probably next uh, week, maybe, um, about my, like, my overall thoughts about the series. Um, did I, if I liked it in general. Um, and I cannot wait to move on to Heroes of Olympus because finally the characters are around my age. Um, I believe Percy was 16 at the end of the first, uh, the last book, and I am now 19, so... They're going to be a little under my age, but as they get older throughout the books, I cannot wait to see their character development. So the last book I read in the month of June uh, was the Fru's Utopia Book Club Book of the Month, and that was Rebel of the Sands by Alan Hamilton. I gave this book a 1 out of 5 stars. I was a little, I was very disappointed. I had really high ups um, going into it, and I guess I wasn't the only one because I did look on Goodreads, and a lot of people seem to have some of the same thoughts as me, but I he was very disappointed in this book. I thought there was, at the very beginning, I thought there was, like, kind of a big plot hole, but maybe that's just me. Um, I did like the idea of this book. I thought, you know, it was going to be really, really good, um, 
I had really high expectations, like I said. Um, and overall, I was very underwhelmed. I actually DNF'd it. I did not finish it. Um, however, I did write really like the writing style of this book. And I may give it another chance in the future. Um, maybe in like another three or four months, maybe I'll give it another chance if I'm into, if I'm like into the genre at the time, because it is kind of a magical realism, um, western feel, um, but I really like the idea of it, Yeah, I really like the writing style, so if the author does put out more books in the future that are not connected to the series, I probably will read them, just to see if, if I liked any of her other books. So that is my monthly wrap up for the month of June. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So my very exciting announcement before I forget um, is I am currently writing a book. I've been working on this for about a month now. Um, I've been writing it for about a month, but I've been thinking about writing about about, about writing a book for like six months now. And I'm finally starting the process. I'm in the very beginning stages of it. So I'm really excited to start this journey with you guys. I will be doing like little monthly updates here and there. Maybe once or twice a month I'll do a little bit of an update. Um, like I'll explain what genre it is, um, what the plot's gonna be, you know, the title of the book, all those things. Um, and I'm really excited to share you guys, share with you guys this incredible journey of writing a book. So that is my very exciting announcement. So if you guys like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. And don't forget to, forget to hit that subscribe button down below if you haven't already. I will have all my social media links in the description box below as well as a link to my blog and my other channel, my personal channel. Those, are, again, will be linked in the description box below. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you next time. Thanks for watching, everybody. Bye!